now we're just waiting for the fairies to leave. Explain to you what happened specifically here in case you're wondering. Finally be able to try some Smith Island cake. Hey, stay! Stay! What are you doing? Hey! So officially I did break my arm and uh, we've been here in the hospital for like two hours. So we just picked up our scripts for pain medicine for the next few days and um, the pharmacist, he went to Smith's Island um, on a, I think it was some, some sort of work trip for education and anyway, bought some oysters there and his sister-in-law basically decorated them as when it was going to sell the oysters and the profits were going to be donated back to Smith Island and so he ended up giving us two of them and look at that, look how pretty that is. There's one and then... Wow. So cool. Yeah. Our day's looking up. Our day's looking up. We made it to the town dock here in Crisfield and now we're just waiting for the ferries to leave. We received recommendation from a lot of different people in the town that Captain Otis is the way to go. So we're gonna ride with him back. It looks like this is also how uh, all of the packages get to the island. So there's about three or, three or four other boats as well. They're just loading Amazon and Walmart and some food packaging. So it's interesting seeing that. And it'll be also interesting to see how long the ferry takes because for Pivot, it's gonna take three hours to get here. Uh, but I imagine these boats go quite a bit faster than Pivot. We have gotten back to the boat. We've been reunited with our girl, and Elliot is resting. So we're finally eating real food in over 24 hours, and we're just so happy about that. Ollie was very happy to see us uh, when we arrived to the bakery in town where Kathy was very generously and very kindly watching her for us. We bought some cake, and now we are going to finally be able to try some Smith Island cake, which is also the state dessert of Maryland, is Smith Island cake. So I'm first trying the chocolate and peanut butter Smith Island cake. That is incredible. Owner of the bakery, Kathy, explained that they pour the batter into pans very in very small, thin layers. And so that creates a very thin layer of cake. And then the, the icing that's between each layer just the combination of it, you get this like nice, not too cakey cake with this awesome, delicious icing. It is so good. Oh my God. Oh my God. Woo! Might need to go back for more cake. It's gonna take me a little while to get used to using a left hand, my left hand for everything, but I have a lemon and cream Smith Island cake. Now the traditional one, I think it was chocolate with vanilla cake, like chocolate icing with vanilla cake. But see, there's so many different flavors now, and these were recommended, so. Mmm. So light and so airy. It's like the perfect type of cake to have on like a hot day, like today. It's great. One of the best parts about these cakes is that they get shipped across the United States. I'm not sure about internationally, but that means that you can enjoy these cakes regardless of where you are in the country. You do not have to come to Smith Island. However, we do recommend coming to Smith Island because it is such a unique place with super kind people.
Oh, we're gonna see what time the restaurant opens and take it very easy day. Two very, very helpful and very, very special people coming to help us. Hey, stay! Stay! What are you doing? Hey! To help us get back to shore and everything with my broken arm. Carol and Luke, who you guys have met before, in... We're back. Yes. They're back. <laughs> They drove 13 hours today, right? 14, but Four, let's not split. 14 they hours, see, they left When did they see us last? Hi, I'm Carol. I'm Jen's mom. Luke is coming on board, and he's going to help us navigate. And so we are enjoying some of the specialty here, which is soft shell crab and crab cakes and Fish, fish sandwich. sandwich. These crab cakes are the best crab cakes I have eaten ever. I feel like I should have gotten four of them instead of... Okay, now push the on button. Well, <laughs> well, Elliot is busy. He's going to find that his crab cake has deteriorated in size. Don't let this fool you. We are super exhausted. So... Uh, sure. Yeah. We are. Today has been, and yesterday, has been very long for us. Yeah. We figured that since we're leaving the stock early early in the morning tomorrow, uh, we just explained to you what happened specifically here in case you're wondering. So it was high tide. I was stepping off the boat. Right here, right now it's low tide, so it's different. So imagine this, but flipped. And I went to go step off, and I missed the step. I have no clue why or how or what I was thinking. I wasn't thinking really. And so I slipped the step and I just tumbled. And then I hit. I have some bruising here on my thigh. Which is probably going to develop into a nice bruise in the next couple of days. So I hit that and I twisted and I fell. And that's when I fractured the, the ulna in my wrist. Basically, I'm not out of the woods yet. The trauma surgeon needs to look at the scans to know if I'll need surgery. but. It'll happen after Memorial Day, which is this weekend. So, with that being said, the bugs here are crazy. The sunset is beautiful, but it's time for us to go. Tomorrow morning, we have a cruise to get back to the mainland uh, and hunker down to let me recover. And um, the bugs are bad. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. And we just wanted to say, <laughs> Thank you to all of the people on the island from the EMT workers, the fire, de fire department, the bakery, um, the just everyone, literally everyone who helped us. Thank you. Um, Absolutely. Yeah. Just Kathy at the bakery had watched Ollie, her family took. And she called EMS for us and they have sirens in the town that blared. Yeah, so just everyone really went above and beyond and we are so grateful for them helping us in a time of need. Yeah, seriously, come to Smith Island, not for any, you know, there's plenty of cultural and culinary reasons to come here, but come for the people. Yeah, they're we, all amazing. We're gonna come again. Yeah, and we're gonna get out of these gnats. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you. What's a 14 hour ride mm. when we're looking at a window that's three minutes and they throw a construction <laughs> site one mile before? No, three and a half miles down. I'm like, maybe we could get out and run faster than they're fixing the road.
too funny. Can't make this up. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, Elliot. You know. <laughs> mm -mm. That is good. Eat it up here because you're not well, getting it at home. You're eating. Actually, you can order it online. Yeah. <laughs> you can get it sent. Seriously? Yeah. yeah. Shipped across the U.S. Oh, crumb drop. Do we need to call Ollie? Lemon. Ollie is sitting here Strawberry. Waiting. Do you want to, um... Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Ollie, you want, I know you want, but it's not available, Ollie, because the crumbs are going right back in my mouth.